This is the World of Sports Network presentation. Saints at the Lions. To see the rest of this episode, please click the link below. Man, the Saints look like they don't even want to play this season, bro. I, I, I don't see, to tell you the truth, I don't see no development, man. I don't see no next man up mantra, you know, with regards to the New Orleans Saints. We know the injury to um, uh, Michael Thomas, but this team look like, it looks bad, man. Like, when I look at this team, for real, since the injury, the only thing I see offensively is Drew Brees throwing it to Alvin Kamara. It's Drew Brees to AK-41. It's like it's like me watching Madden. You ever have a Madden play that just uses just one guy? That's what I see. I'm telling you, oh, it's one of those high school teams that has that one superior athlete. It might be a one, one black athlete, and all of a sudden, they're using him on a toss split. They're using him on a pass split. They're using him on a quarterback, running back. I mean, shoot, if it's not the NFL, if it's not for Drew Brees, they'll probably put Alvin Kamara on quarterback, man. Man. But with that said, I lost all the trust in New Orleans, man. I don't, I don't like anything about New Orleans right now, man. I don't like the, what their makeup. I don't like their heart. It seemed like they were just one of those teams that's always feeling bad for themselves, feeling sad for themselves, and I don't work like that. Now, Detroit Lions had a hell of a week defeating Kyler Murray, which I predicted last week, and I anticipate them to compound that victory and take on a, uh, the uh, New Orleans Saints, who's miserable and complaining, and put them out of their misery. I expect the Detroit Lions so in a close, close battle, 28-27 Detroit, 28-27 Detroit. So I want to hear from you guys. Let me know what y'all think, and I want to hear your prediction, man. Leave a comment before below, like, comment. Y'all know the drill, man. I'm the G to the U to the R to the U, and I am out.